Greetings. Recently, whilst pottering in my garden, my thoughts have strayed to the subject of North Korea. The Democratic People's Republic of Korea, to give it its full title, is in no way democratic. I always say be careful of countries with democratic or peoples in their name. The nation doth protest too much. I mean, Heathrow and JFK, they are clearly international airports. Birmingham International Airport, the less said the better. Two flights a week to the Isle of Man does not an international airport make. Charlton Athletic, a football team of deep fried Mars bar lovers that is primarily obese. North Korea is a totalitarian regime governed by the much feared and despised Workers' Party of Korea. Just as here, Korea politicians are very unpopular. North Korea was created in 1945 when the Korean Peninsula was split in two along the line of latitude known as the 38th parallel. Speaking of parallels, there are striking similarities between North Korea and my household, both ruled by a man with eccentric hair who came to power at the expense of a less ambitious sibling. Both officially atheist, but with secret Buddhist leanings. Both striving for self-sufficiency, despite mounting external pressure slash sanctions from Wickham District Council. Which brings me to the issue of my slugs. They have ravished my lettuces. My dilemma is should I use some pellets that will kill them by the rather unpleasant method of detonation or use natural methods such as wool that will merely deter the slugs. Now before you write in I'm aware that I'm showing you the damage done to my hosta plant. The holes in my lettuces I consider too harrowing to view. Should the international community take an aggressive stance with the highly militarised, warmongering North Korean dictatorship? Or should we use only peaceful, diplomatic means against Kim Jong Slug? But is that just moving the problem on? to South Korea. I'm not saying I have all the answers, but I am going to put some beer out for the slugs and I'd advise you not to antagonise the North Koreans. May the blessings of our supreme leader, Robot May, of the Democratic Urinary Party, be upon you.